Hey, listen, I want to tell you this. I want to tell you this because I care about you. And the truth is, the difference between extraordinary and ordinary is just little margin. And the margin is literally trying the 10%. For the ones that want to become extraordinary, they sacrifice their time for their greatness. So let's say, for example, you know for sure you, you, you need to save a little bit. You know for sure you need to apply for a job. You know for sure you need to work a little bit hard to get your results and your goals. You know for sure you need to send few emails or contact few people to get a job, an opportunity. But you will choose to be ordinary. But the ones that want to become really successful and the ones that really want to get that job, that want to get those opportunities, they just add the extra 10% that will make them extraordinary. And that's the, the difference, it's quite simple. That's why you see people, people are living in their thousands and some are living in their millions, right? And the difference between the thousands and the millions is just the millions decide to be extraordinary and they've always add 10% to the things that they wanna do. You've been at the gym and you're pushing, you're meant to do like 12, 12 reps and you go one, two, three, four, five, six, you get to 12, and then all of a sudden you, you, you're, you're done. You just stop there. But listen, the ones that wanna become great, the ones that wanna become better and better, they go up to 13, they go to 14. Just that little percentage brings out the muscle much better, brings out more definition, takes them to another level. If you stop at 12, while well, others can achieve more, then that's a difference. So you really want to choose wisely here. If you want to become great, if you want to become great, you really need to, to do a little bit extra. You need to stay up late. You need to wake up early. You need to do a lot of great things. You need to do a lot of these things. That's the difference between everyone else. Because the earlier you wake up, the longer you have more time to do things. And that's the difference. Majority of people don't understand that. They feel like, yeah, I need you. Ah, it's all right, man. I got time. Boy, girl, you ain't got no time. You don't have no time. You really need to work on your game, especially when you ain't got nothing. If you don't have nothing, grind, push, find those opportunities. Wake up early in the morning and go into your grind and start achieving it. Trust me. Your body will tell you when you need to rest. Your mind will tell you, yeah, Lawrence, hey, you've done enough today, man. You, you gotta rest. You gotta go. You gotta go chill out. You need, you need to, 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 to relax. You will know this when you're putting in work. Majority of people, they just don't even, <laughs> they don't even, they've never even get to that point where the body tells them, oh, you need to rest. Some of them just woke up just because they're tired from sleeping long hours. And they'll be like, ah, I'm tired. I need to sleep. Your body's just tired because you've been sleeping longer than the usual. You haven't done nothing with your body, of course it's tired. Our brain is choosing to always be tired and lazy and choosing the easy option out for ourselves. That's why our, our brain is designed to do that. The moment your, your brain the, the, uh, what it's, finds itself at a happy moment and it's happy, it's relaxed, right? It wants, your brain will want to stay there. It doesn't want to create change. It doesn't want to go to do things that's going to be, create a lot of pressure onto it. That's how your brain is designed to look after you, to protect you, to be happy, to just be in the moment. And that's why people think, oh, yeah, I'm tired, man. I'm just going to chill. I'm just going to sleep. Time is going. But you, if you push your, your brain to another level, that's when you start achieving. And then your brain is like, Man, this guy is pushing me hard. I need to adapt. Mentally, you start adapting. Okay? So it's how you communicate to your brain. That's how the brain takes the certain action, which then makes your body feel lazy. And then all of a sudden you say, nah, I'm tired. I want to sleep. It's just lies. Think about what you're doing. Because you're slowing down your progress. You're slowing down your time to achieve. And when you now get to a point where you cannot move anymore, you start blaming everything around you when you had all this time to grind especially when you're young okay that's the time you need to really push and get those things done out of the way so now you can enjoy and relax more than when you get a little bit older 
think smart guys choose the right options i'm just here to tell you guys that change your mindset start thinking okay challenge your brain to 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 grow with you otherwise you and your brain together is going to become lazy and just sleep and rest <laughs> listen it's lawrence shuruma here talking about the ego mentality always change your mind get out of your comfort zone choose the ego mentality as usual love you guys ciao